General Turgeson, what's going on here? In less than 15 minutes from now, the Ruskies will be making radar contact with the planes. We will suffer virtual annihilation. We've got an election coming up where Australians have to make an important decision about who is best to lead them in these incredibly uncertain times. Go ahead, General. Labor just doesn't measure up to the mark of our government when it comes to national security. What I want to do is unite the country. What Scott Morrison keeps trying to do as a desperate political measure is divide the country. Frankly, on this issue, they're weak. Look, this is a government that's a lesser government than a bin fire. The fact is that his deputy prime minister said he's observed that Scott Morrison is a hypocrite and a liar. Where did you get all this information? How do we know that? Because this is a cabinet that leaks so hard it feels more like a dam bursting. It certainly does. Far beyond the point I would have imagined possible. I told you never to call me here. Don't you know where I am? It is not in Australia's interest to look for false distinctions. Labor's form in this space is very ordinary. And I don't think there's any problem in pointing that out. Right. Gentlemen, this is outrageous. I have never heard of such behaviour in the war room before. I want to speak to General Ripper on the telephone personally. Yes, sir. Take me to the April sun in Cuba. Oh. Take me to the April sun in Cuba. I can't remember the words. Oh. Be careful, Mr. President. I think he is drunk. There we go. This man is obviously a psychotic. 